Let's talk about the general use of image flow uh, for the operator while inspection is running. As you can see, we're inspecting here. It's just detected a splash. And I want to explain to you what each and all of these buttons do. If I zoom in, this button here allows me to zoom back out. I can zoom in on this particular defect here and zoom back out. This button here allows me to snap an image of the complete web and store it. Very useful if something strange is happening and the operator wants to, um, uh, wants to make a recording of it. This here allows the operator view the live web so he can zoom in, zoom out, move in, move out. This here uh, uh, displays the last defect that was detected. So if this is left on, when a new defect comes in, it will display that defect and freeze it on the screen. Often defect detection systems are left in this particular mode because if you are in the live mode and a defect comes in, of course, once the defect has moved on, the screen would be updated. If you leave, if you leave it in this, the last defect will always be shown. Finally, this button over here turns on, over, on and off the overlay on the actual display. Sometimes the overlay can, um, can obscure um, the defect from the operator. So if he wants to zoom in and look at it, he can uh, get a better view by turning this on and off. Zoom back out. And over here, the inspection is carrying on, as you can see. And it gives a complete list of every defect that has happened during this inspection. And the operator may click on any one of these and zoom back in and look at the defect. While he selected the one of these defects, the actual display will not update, but the inspection will continue, as you can see here on the right-hand side. So it's a very useful um, function. So he gets a full, a full record of every single defect that was detected and the time it was detected and the location. And of course, the actual class of the defect. At the end of inspection, he simply hits stop and all of this data is then stored so that it can be used in your workflow or for uh, generating reports. Thank you very much.